Today in Western Mass and across the border in Connecticut, Hot Table opened on a Sunday for the first time in 14 years. Normally they are closed to give employees a break, but the owners decided to open their doors and fire up the kitchen for a good cause. Western Mass News reporter Brice de Landa Verde has the details. It's honestly a win-win for all of us. <laughs> Panini lovers rushing in to get their favorites at Hot Table in Springfield on Sunday. I love Hot Table. It's like the best thing ever. So, I mean, that mixed with, you know, charity is it's great. Normally, the business is closed on Sundays to give employees time to relax and spend time with their friends and family. It's always been a day set aside for our staff to rest uh, after a long week of, of making paninis for our guests. But for the first time since opening shop in 2007, the owners decided to welcome guests at all seven locations this Sunday, both in Western Mass and Connecticut, to help fight hunger. John DeVoy, the co-founder of Hot Table, tells Western Mass News all the proceeds from the event Seventh day will go towards local food banks. We've really been blessed with a lot of great business, a lot of loyalty from our customers. And again, you know, we just felt the need to give back to the community. Helping residents in both neighboring states. It's the Food Bank of Western Massachusetts, the Food Bank of Worcester County, and uh, the Connecticut Food Bank. Customers that we spoke to just happy to support the fundraising efforts. We actually get to see that the reason that they're open is for a good cause. It's pretty sweet. And while this was the first year they held this event, DeVoy says they may hold it on a yearly basis. For now, reporting in Springfield, Brice de Landa Verde for Western Mass News. DeVoy also sharing some new information with Western Mass News that Hot Table plans to open four more locations within the next 10 months, including right here in Chicopee and in Westfield and two across the border in Connecticut.